have you all seen this? Okay, look in the back. That woman was in the VIP section of a recent Donald Trump rally. Uh, she says she went because she should never turn down the chance to see a presidential candidate. And when she got there, she and her friends were offered seats right behind Trump. Mm -hmm. uh, but after some protesters got kicked out of the event, she lost interest and decided to read her book, Citizen, <laughs> which is a collection of poems about race in America. The picture of her reading in the stands has gone viral. Many arguing that she was disinterested. She should have left, not read. What do we think here? I heard her speak, and, you know, she's very smart. She got there early. She brought her books because she knew she was going to be waiting online. And they also, of course, sat her there on purpose. Right. And the protesters came in. She said it was a young African-American woman. And instead of saying, you know, this is America and we have free speech and that's what's great about America, but I'm going to continue on now. He said, get out of here. Get the hell out of here. And she found it really disrespectful. And I don't blame her. Mm -hmm. And she took out this amazing book of poetry about race in America. And I, uh, you know, if you're going to talk about civil disobedience, that is, is such a powerful way to get a message out. I think that that was an incredible thing she did. Yeah. Well, honey, she, it's good, because I would have fell asleep. I was a fan <laughs> of Donald Trump for many years. I, you know, I loved Donald Trump growing up, and I always would thought, you know, I always thought that I would end up on Celebrity Apprentice. I was mm -hmm. a big fan. Until, you know, he made a couple of statements, and I was like, oh, okay, right. I'm not here for those. Mm -hmm. So, honey, I would have read, too. I would have fell asleep. I would have used my anytime minutes <laughs> anytime. I mean, <laughs> you know, honestly, it's just like, when you think somebody is one way, you perceive them to be a certain way, and then you see that they're kind of <laughs> You read. You read. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna tell you something. I love it. You are very, very funny. Thank you. Period. And I know funny all day long. You are very funny. Thank you. You are very thought-provoking and crazy. <laughs> and you were spot on with a lot of your analysis. I'm telling you, the thing about the Kardashian girls, that was spot on. It is. I enjoyed this panel. I thought you guys were great. It was a Thank great you. blend. Thank you. I loved you all for coming. Thank you all. Thanks to Sheena, Tanisha, and Judy. Don't forget to tune in to Judy's podcast, Kill Me Now with Judy Gold. It's on <laughs> iTunes and play it. We'll be right back, folks. Yeah. Hey, folks, welcome. Uh, thanks for checking out my YouTube channel. Don't forget to click here to subscribe to my channel. That way, you won't miss a single hot new video, some really good stuff. And then I want you to click here to see more clips from the show right now.